in a similar vein to useful documents being configured for patients to be able to access, you're also able to configure and break down a number of rehabilitation or rehab documents that patients can access through their rehabilitation section on their Autos portal. The ones displayed on screen are associated with a diagnosis of coronary artery disease and are broken down into the following sections, exercise, diet and nutrition, and well-being as well. If we take a look at the exercise examples here, we have five resources that are made available to patients who have a diagnosis of coronary artery disease, including understanding physical activities, physical activity in your heart, and then stages one, two, and three of the British Heart Foundation Cardiac Rehab Programme. There's a short description that is displayed to the patient about the resource available to them, as well as the ability to see the date created within the platform and to be able to download a, uh, a copy to, of the resource itself to review this uh, in line with um, updating guidelines or local best practice. You can also delete resources as, uh, as needed uh, simply by selecting the delete function here. If you wanted to add in uh, another resource exercise, uh, an exercise resource rather, simply select add new, give the resource a title, a short description as previously outlined, associate it with a diagnosis, and again, this is a key step, and then select your attachment from your local files, select save, and that will then uh, be provided to any patient who has a diagnosis of coronary artery disease. Now, associating the resource with coronary artery disease or the apl applicable diagnosis is important because this then automates the process for which patients get um, the rehabilitation documents sent to them as soon as they are um, added on to a diagnosis of coronary artery disease.